गुड मॉर्निंग मैडम गुड मॉर्निंग गिव मी योर रेजन यस मैम ओके मोनिका टेल मी अबाउट योर सेल्फ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थैंक यू थैंक यू मैडम थैंक यू फॉर गिविंग दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी टू इंट्रोड्यूस माई सेल्फ माई सेल्फ मोनिका आई एम फ्रॉम भद्राद्रि कोगुड़ा बट करेंटली स्टेइंग इन हैदराबाद अबाउट माई फैमिली माई फैमिली कंसिस्ट ऑफ फोर मेबर्स इंक्लूडिंग मी ई रीसेंटली कंप्लीटेड माई बी टेक् फ्रम कोदाड़ा इंस्टिट्यूट आफ टेक्नोलॉजी इन दि स्ट्रीम आफ एलेक्ट्रिकल एंड एलेक्ट्रॉनिक इंजीनियरिंग एंड मई कंप्लीट ई कंप्लीटेड मई डिप्लोमा इन दि स्ट्रीम आफ एलेक्ट्रिकल एंड एलेक्ट्रॉनिक इंजीनियरिंग फ्रम अनुबोस इंस्टिट्यूट आफ टेक्नोलॉजी एंड मई स्कूल कंप्लीटेड मई स्कूल इन जेपी जी एस एस हई स्कूल पालवंज कमिंग टू टेक्निकल पार्क डिफरेंस बिटवीन री नेम्स एंड री डिफाइंस Yes, ma'am. Renames means it is a sixty-six level number, and redefines means conditional conditional building. And uh, renames we can use re- regrouping the variables or renaming the single variable. And uh, re re means reusing the already existing memory from uh, upcoming variable to new variable. And when two or more variables store the same value. we can prefer the redefines yeah difference between string and unstring yes ma'am string means group of characters and we, it is represented in quotes uh, string combine to combine one multiple substring sing, substrings into single string and uh, there are three types of delimiters uh, size space and u- user defined Uh, that's it and uh, unstring to split multiple substrings into one string they are two types of delimiters uh, space and uh, user defined if you try to use size it will get compilation error difference between comp and com3 yes ma'am comp1 and com3 both are memory reducing techniques uh, com comp we we can store the binary format and uh, comp3 or we can store hexadecimal format uh, and, uh, comp1 and comp3 uh, will each and every digit will take the memory and comp3 and comp and comp3 are uh, not readable format we can use sort utility and cobol program we can convert into readable format what is initialize statement in cobol yes ma'am initialize means we can reset the variables based on data type uh, if it is numeric we can reset to zeros if it is alphabetic and alphanumeric reset to spaces why occur clause was not defined in 011 if you try to we if you try to declare in 01 level it uh, it will get compilation error because it will take only subgroup level difference between subscript and index yes ma'am uh, subscript it represents the position of the element and index it will set offset or uh, uh, number of displacement position position of the table starting starting position of the table and index is uh, indexed indexed clause is not mandatory in index indexed clause is mandatory and subscript uh, used for uh, performs move statements and uh, display set display statement indexed um, it re, you can use performs or either performs or set and uh, subscript lower than uh, indexed and index is faster than compared to subscript copy book is yes. if the same data layout repeated in number of programs instead of writing data layout we can code the separate pdfs with a member uh, we can prefer Uh, copy book we can call it as copy book uh, copy book means code once and uh, use multiple times uh, syntax copy copy with member name what is the purpose of copy with replacement as yes, by using copy book 
we can use same copy book uh, within the same program more than one time what are the class conditions in cobol where we will use yes we can use the class condition for conditional statements like if and evaluate there are seven types of class condition is numeric is alphabetic is alphabetic upper is alphabetic lower uh, is sign positive is sign negative and uh, is ne is zero uh, first one is is ne is numeric uh, to check the given variable value is alphabetic is numeric or not and second one is all is alphabetic to check the given variable value is alphabetic or not and third one is alphabet is alphabetic uh, upper uh, to to check the given variable value alphabetic upper or not and fourth one is uh, alphabetic lower uh, to check the given variable value uh, is lower or not and uh, alpha sign positive it, uh, it check the particular value is positive or not and uh, sign n is negative to check the particular value is negative or not and uh, is zero to check the uh, particular value zero or not